Welcome my old besties and my new besties. How y'all doing? Don't forget to hit the notification bell, like, and subscribe, and tell me how you doing today in the comment section below. You guys know I care. So, we're jumping back in methods. We're going to get this over with because somebody kind of spoiled it for me and let me know that I'm at the end. So, I'm guessing it's going to be like another chapter after this. And then, boom, I'm going to be at the end. I'm going to cry because this game is actually really good. And a lot of people don't be really paying attention to it. But there are a few of you guys that are on my channel right now that actually do like it. So, I'm not going to you know put everybody down but i'm just saying if you don't like it you don't have to watch it anyways i'm gonna shut up now after meeting the new meeting her new partner an eccentric detective who's currently ranked in the third in the mysterious competition okay remember her partner is 772 and uh detective 772 and he pretty much is uh just a weirdo and i'm, I'm trying to you know discover my weirdo voice for him because I don't want him to have like a weird, weird voice, but I want him to have a weird voice. <laughs> detective Neil heads back to the waiting room as the detectives prepare for the fourth round. I stared at the pale cold colored ceiling, lost in thought. So we're still Neil, okay? I can't wait for Detective Hackett to get up there. That way so he knows. <laughs> so he gets to meet this guy. I want to see what his uh, his reaction is. There were cracks in the paint and thought and though them I could through them Jesus oh my god let me take a deep breath already I'm hopped up on coffee so I do apologize and through them I could see I could barely just barely see the glint of a camera lens poking through they sure know how to hide them I greeted nearly everyone on the fourth floor by now though I never talked to the top three detectives unless I had to so she already knows who the top three detectives this. So we know uh, it's Honor or Honor. Or, yeah, it's Honor. Detective Honor. Because they mentioned him in the beginning of the game. Detective B Ruby, uh, July Red or something like that. Some, uh, Detective uh, Red July. Got it. There you go. Detective Red July and then Detective 772 who we are with. Detective 772 had been the first one I'd actually met, but seeing as he was more impressive than I thought at first, he was sort of scared to talk to the detectives with the actual reputation like Red Ru July. Red July? I keep wanting to call her Red Ruby. It would have sound better to me. Like, you guys let me know in the comment section below. I feel like it would sound a lot better. I'd heard somewhere that she slows down when she's solving a crime, trying to take as long as possible and yet still comes in under a minute. Jesus Christ, she's good. Ever since I heard that, I tried it myself, but of course that ended in miserable failure. <laughs> Look, when you have your own method of doing stuff and then people try to do the same thing that you're doing, it's like, it's like a person playing cards and they're able to count the cards by seeing the cards in, your, in their hand and seeing what you throw on the table. They're able to count the cards and, and and guess the right card I cannot do that if I tried to do that I'd probably lose every time but there are people out there that can really count cards and it's crazy like I've seen um, this video on YouTube if I remember the video I'll put it in the description box uh, down below but <clears throat> there's this guy that was counting cards and stuff and he was really good at it like he guessed every card perfectly correct now I don't know if they set it up for him but I'm just saying he did it right but it was my first day after all oh yeah she is a new detective again if you haven't seen this you're gonna have to go back and watch the rest of them I put them all in a little playlist for y'all so y'all can go back and watch them anytime you want the new partners were announced but it didn't matter since I was still with detective 772 actually his name had changed to detective 773 since he just solved the new case. Oh yeah, he's counting up his cases, forgot. Though the game master had told me the top three spots were locked with the partners they got from the start, it wasn't entirely true. There was a condition, oh. If the partner didn't contribute to solving the case, they got swapped out. That's only fair though. I mean, you don't wanna work with somebody who isn't doing work, so Detective Hackett probably won't make it, <laughs> I'm just saying. 
I remember how in command of the crime scene, Detective 773 had been, and it got a bit wor- and I got a bit worried that I'd be given the boot. Yeah, because she was really like confused, but we still figured it out, y'all. But this time I was determined to do more and not just yell at him to stop messing around. I didn't want to get switched out when I had just gotten to third. There was a certain gambling aspect though, because you could also not do anything on purpose to see if you get partnered with an even higher spot. So the question was, were you willing to risk a good spot for a better one? Ooh, hello, lost in thought. What to take a bit of a risk? Maybe. What would you say if I could get you? Oh, sorry, he switched stance. What would you say if I could get you into contact with Red July? My heart flipped and flopped with a sudden nervousness. Into contact with Red July? That'd be cool. Uh, great, sure. I will introduce you so that you won't feel intimidated. No thanks. That'd probably make it even more awkward. You don't even know what she looks like, do you? I realized I didn't actually know. However, I talked with as many people as I could and everyone had thought the same thing. Isn't that her? No. That's the quiet detective who solved cases in silence. She doesn't ever speak, but when she does, it's always one word. One word, I promise y'all, if y'all heard that, that was my chair, I did not poot. I did not scoot and poot, I promise y'all. The one word that the key, <laughs> that's the key to the mystery. It probably takes her longer to think of which word to say than it does to solve the case. So Red July, so who's Red July then? Her. Wait, whoa, <laughs> wait a minute. Which one? Which one is, you know what? The one on the right, I uh, got it. I see I should have read it first before I said anything. Now I feel silly. Wow, I didn't know she had, she was a twin. She isn't. Her current partner is Master of Disguise, Detective Hon <laughs> Detective Honor. So the one on the right with the darkish brown hair is Red July, and the other one with the light blondish hair is uh, Detective Honor. The detective is pretending to be Red July. What? That's incredible. I actually talked to both of them before I <laughs> before and I never would have guessed but how'd you know he gave me an irritating wink three things the eyes the actions and the name tag I glanced over it to the twins the name tag on the left read hashtag know myself and the name tag on the right one read "No myself that uh, that if you were hearing that you probably would have been like I'm so confused but seeing it <laughs> you get it obviously know myself refers to how detective honor never is herself and know myself refers to red July's reputation which is the largest of any of the detectives here I doubt that their matchup was random coincidence, given how their name tags have a similar play on words. Oh, now that you say it, it is pretty obvious. It's like an Oreo. No, not really. I promise y'all that's the chair. I, I'm like rocking side to side. Cause you know my hips hurting right now if you guys don't know i'm in physical therapy i got injured at work and my hip is killing me okay but right now i'm just rocking side to side because it hurts and it makes it feel a little bit better because i'm sitting in a chair i'd have i had enough of his cheeky shtick 
the announcement jingle was heard. It's almost time for the fourth round. Get ready, detectives. I felt the push from behind and suddenly I was standing right in front of Red July. I angrily glanced back to Detective 773, who was waving cheerfully. You can do it! The jerk. Now it was going to be even harder to ease the awkwardness. Uh, hi. No! I'd ruined the chance for a cool introduction like I see your name tag. <laughs> I've done this before. I've like, okay, you're going to go in, you're going to say this, and you're going to say that, and it's going to be cool. And then I'll go in and she'll be like, hello. I'm so awkward if you guys ever met me in person. I'm super awkward. I see from your name tag <clears throat> that you were not who you appear to be. Or my name's Neil, and your name's Red July, isn't it? Hello, Neil. Oh, okay, so what I'm going to do is blonde hair, red July. I'm going to give a higher pitched voice and other original darker hair, darker suit, red July. I'm going to give a lower voice. So this is Detective Honor that's talking. Hello, Neil. Sorry about the trickery. I'm red July. So pleased to meet you, Detective Honor. And you, Detective Red July. Good call. But one made by Detective 773. How do you know? How do you know? It was becoming my catchphrase. I know the feeling. When you talked to us earlier, you didn't know. And after you talked to 773, you did. The way you were glancing over here was exceedingly obvious. Oh? Yeah, it was obvious, huh? Apparently, lots of obvious things needed to be pointed out to me by smarter detectives. Sure made me feel like a dope. Listen, Neil. Your future is a light, <laughs> light trunk tree, but its branches are as dark as the night. Oh, don't deviate. Stay a detective. And if you start to lean into other lines of work, correct yourself immediately. Are they dark as in unknown or dark as in bad? I'm not very good with metaphors, even when they're not about <laughs> Oreos. I don't know what that man's thing is with Oreos. They're dark as in mysterious, and they will be mysterious as long as you can't solve the mystery. Oh, I was making a fool of myself, but I had so many questions. There was enough time to, there wasn't enough time to ask them all, sorry. Okay, so, going into this, I know it, the good ones would probably be like, ask about you know, how is it with Detective Honor about her method? Actually, about her method would be a lot better than asking about Detective Honor or tips. But because we are partnered right now with 773, I feel like we need to know more about 773 going into this. So what do you think about 773? Does he annoy you? He honestly doesn't annoy me. I don't know why Neil don't like him. Annoyance is failure to understanding. Hmm... That is kind of a really cool thing to say, and it's really actually accurate. And I'm not attempting to understand those things. I don't know how he got to be the way, be that way, but he doesn't annoy me. No. Help him understand you, and you will understand him. That was certainly a different perspective. He annoys you less if you ignore him. Thanks for the translation. <laughs> no problem. Detectives. Detectives, detectives, detectives. So many detectives. Oh, sorry. Game master voice. I'm still doing Neil's voice. <clears throat> I know you guys. Some people's like, I can't tell the difference. Okay, look. I'm not good at the voices, okay? Well, the fourth round is ready for you. 
So no need to keep pretending you like talking to each other. I was still puzzling over Red July's tree metaphor. I guess top three detectives love metaphors because it makes them sound more intelligent. I remember 773's Oreo metaphor and suddenly I realized that he was parroting <laughs> Red July. That's funny. The longer I spent with him, the more sense he made. Or maybe I was just deluding myself, thinking I could figure him out. Or maybe the real delusion was <laughs> that there was there was anything to solve at all. Alright, so let's go ahead and get into this lovely, lovely, lovely. It's different. No! Y'all gonna do me like that? This ain't true. This, this isn't. Thank you for playing Methods. You have reached the end of the current available chapters. Method is a visual novel adaption of the novel that is started working on five years ago. The novel version currently has about 55 chapters written. Though each one is short... They make time, 55 chapters, make time to implicate them because <clears throat> each one needs revision. Okay, background, spites, music, and, you know, for chapters with mysteries, game design, and coding. It's a huge story with the cast of over 100 chapters. This is, <laughs> this visual novel is the best possible way to experience the story. So... Unless I am able to complete this, which is possible, I will not be releasing the novel. Um, keep an eye out for future releases. <sighs> Locked on. Why'd you do me like that? This this was getting so good. Oh, man. Thank you guys for watching. I'm sorry, you guys. I didn't know that the rest of them were, you know, released. This kind of broke my heart a little bit, but I hope you guys enjoyed it like I did. I'm going to keep an eye out on Locked On's channel, make sure he do he uploads some. And if he does upload some, we'll jump right back into this. But for now, this is the end. I'm sorry, you guys. And I will see all you lovely people in the next video. Bye.